Hello there everyone and welcome back to the Hearts of Iron 4 mod of Road to 56 in which we're playing as everyone's favorite Communist Japan but right now we've invaded Southeast Asia, French Indochina more specifically and we're doing quite well as we are struggling a little bit against the Axis over here um, yeah, that's not going great and, oh, popular front block uh, let's take a look here now, America's in the Commonwealth of Nations, which is fine with me. We're going to deal with them until the end, maybe. But, uh, yeah, let's focus on the Axis. And we're going to take out Guangxi Clique just because I want to directly annex them. Uh, because all of the resources. We need resources. We really, really, really need resources. Well, maybe not. Of course, we're on limited exports, but so. But we're doing the Red Pacific Fleet, which is very nice. Red El Pacifico Fleeto. Uh, where, where, where is it? Where is it? Ah. But we will rebuild our fleet along ideological criteria. That's nice. Our greatest enemy versus a Asian common solidarity. Guard the revolution, which wouldn't be bad. Um, our greatest enemy during the Comptern. We're technically already part of the common turn. Um, I don't really want to take out the Soviets at this point since we're all allied. So I want to reignite the Chinese Civil War, though. And liberate Korea would be fun, but let's do the greatest enemy. We cannot stand alone against the world. We set our old differences aside and can stand together with the birthplace of communism and protect the revolution, which I don't understand why it doesn't autocomplete, but whatever. Combos go bye-bye. Yes, please. Yeah, we're doing quite well down here, though. I'm going to take out these guys, get some more resources, get some more factories, stuff like that. And maybe we'll send some soldiers down and help out those guys over there, too. Because that's not looking very good over there at all. But that's alright. You know, we'll get there. Keep going. We should probably help out, man. Beat them up. Make sure they can't move. I love it when they can't move. Ooh, infantry specialists. Yeah, we we're losing a lot of infantry. 5 and 10. Um, Harokichi. You'll be using this a whole bunch. And you'll be leveling up a whole bunch anyways. So I don't mind using you then. There you go. Very good. Head back up north. Go straight for Hanoi if you can. Anything here? Um... Uh, Ah, French and Chinese gone. Very good. I don't take these guys together, which would be great. Recent immigrant flux, if you want to go that, please go ahead. Get ah, Marines. Because we will need to invade Australasia as well. It's of course 1939. The war is probably going to start very soon ish, but we'll see what happens with them. Um, nothing really there we can do. 1940 stuff. Not interested in too many other stuff either. Ship stuff is always good to do as well. Uh, oh. Anti air, maybe. Guns. Good. Marines, of course. I never use any special other stuff here, too. Uh, not really. Ooh, engineers, logistics. Go logistics. I love logistics. What is this? Marines Revolution to Guangxi Clique. If you want to put that, please go ahead. Nice. Not better for your artillery. Good. I was going to send these guys down to uh, French and China, but we, as you can tell, already capitulated them. Which is pretty good. Pretty darn good. You need a Najaz and Najaz. What? Um. Well, Alright. Oh, there's Austin. Wow. They actually just gave it up. Wow, that's disgusting too. Um. UK. Well, I guess the allies no longer exist. Oh! I hope they go to war with the Italians. They must have gone take out this group. Well, I guess they didn't do alliance. They did do non infantry with Germany. I guess France is in the alliance as well. So we'll see. I mean, I guess. Popular. Well, who the heck is in this group? At least you guys are communists, that's good. Uh-oh. Hey, that's not bad. <clears throat> we'll definitely take that. But we'll these guys. We'll start annexing these guys up. We won't give it to China, pretty much. Um, Madrid did follow us as well, which is good. Anything else here? Check the Air Force, ground support, air superiority. I do like air superiority. You have aviation, commerce rating, Bulgaria, Smith, Romania. Yeah, let's go with this guy. Naval stuff, that's good. And over here. Engineers? Sure, why not? Cool. And another ship. Oh, another carrier. Look at that. 
Do you have... No, you don't. Wow. The city is pretty good. The USSR has accepted us as coming to members, which they already technically did. But whatever. The USSR has decided to support or accept our request to join the Comintern. That's worth will stand or fall together. <clears throat> Followed up with... Ooh. Well, that sounds nice. Soviet-Japanese Technological Exchange. We're say United, we must share weapons research to deter all threats against bo us both. Revisions are not bad. Train for now, we can. Get some more research done, such as military police. No, we did that one. Can answer, please? Yes, you can. Which is 62, nice. Recon, yes. Um, import Soviet armor. Soviet Union has made significant breakthroughs uh, in the developing its armored vehicles in recent years. And with the minuscule armored ports of our own, we have much to learn um, as well. How much to learn of them, so. Now ah, that makes sense. Long she click. Give me planes. We have a few, not a ton. Some dive bombers too. Anti air upgrades, nice. Can you bomb them, so be it. Give me more immigrants. We love the immigrants. Mechanized infantry. Um, maybe that one, why not? That's where they join the Axis, and we could go to the war of these guys too. Incompetent army is just good. Do they also have incompetent army? Oh, there goes the Irish in the those guys. Oh! Okay! Ah, oh, they do have an incompetent army. We should be able to do this pretty darn easily then. Confederate European nations. Nice. Very nice. 739. I'll go over here. Let's do some of this stuff. Here. Get more recovery rate. Why not? Oh, they actually have tanks. Look at that. I was not expecting tanks from these guys. And these divisions, they're all, all over the place. Yeah, we can make these guys a little thicker. A little better. Let's get oil fields. Yes, please. Oh. Are you... No? Okay. You know, we push them one front. Okay, well, I understand. It's going to have to happen then. There you go. Very nice. Hey. Not bad. Not bad at all. Alright, so with this, we could probably use more military factories. Do that too. Hey, there they go. Oh, as this group. Um, I don't think we're really interested. There you go. Have fun with them. Use some heavy holes, yes. Let's get the worn shana, no. That'd be a bad idea right now. It's nice. Good. So hopefully now we can put down a lot of rebels and stuff like that. Did they take Guangxi? No, he didn't come into the war. Why do you get that province if you didn't come into the war? I'm taking that province when we're done here. Oh, we're going to kill these guys in the end. If we don't kill America in this campaign, so be it. But... <coughs> Excuse me. Um, yeah, we're going to have to die them. I just plan to kill them off anyways, but still. Oh god, spots are gonna suck doing this. Oh, where'd they go? Not have garrison or manpower? Oh, I need more sport equipment, which makes sense. Need more dockyards, sport equipment. That's why I put the whole military factories up here, hopefully. There's so armor. 
Um, what else do we want for this one? Out operations, XP is fine. After this one, the Red Dog Borontius. Red Dog Borontius. Our struggle does not end here. We must see to lift up other nations as well. Our best and brightest shall be sent forth to champion and cause in those nations that have embraced the revolution. Cool. Oh, Red Brigade, yeah. That's really nice. That's actually very nice. Um, 1939. It's almost 1940. Look at that. Look at that, too. Breakthrough, soft attack, good stuff like that. Very good. Oh, Asin is dying a little bit. Good, good, good. As long as we don't go to war with the Americans, that's super, super important. Could use a little bit more aluminum, though. And that's totally fine with me. More sorority efficiency is good. Oh, hello. What's going on? Who, who's... Ah... Your subby boys. I see. Floating harbors. Sub mine lane. I have a mine damage. Uh, get that one. We'll probably get one eventually. Sink every sub they got. If anything you want to help, put some radar down here. That'll help. Quite a bit, actually. Ooh, anything here? No. He's level 5. We'll plan an attack. We can wait. Nice. Pretty good. Yeah, I'm still taking all of, uh, of these Chinese territories. I don't care what China wants. It's an, an alliance of convenience. Good. Kill them all off. We could strike the old oppressors, but... The U.S. has held down uh, for too long with the capitalist imperial tyranny. We can allow this to happen again. We must end this once for all. <clears throat> or the revolution. Only ideologically liable agents can act in favor of the revolution. At home and abroad, they will hunt counter revolutionaries. Become the vanguard of the liberation of the workers of Asia. <clears throat> Excuse me. No oh boy. We do have some coffee here too, which is very nice. Very yummy. Very good. Awesome. Grab some of that. We'll get some better planes, get some better ships, stuff like that. But we're gonna get more of this too. Lost the convoy, huh? Extra supplies, maybe? Well, they do force defense. It's kind of nice for us. Any damage we do, they cannot really recover from. Oh, the Maklik. We joined them. It's fine. They can... Try can have that, Maklik. We'll take these guys. Reserve transfer. Nice. Fabius lander. Very good. Ah, they capitulated, which they should give us these resources and factories and stuff. I'm taking them at the end. I don't care. Um, you're the tank, so I don't want to send the tanks this way. Hmm. Join the commentary already, huh? Mm, alrighty. Well, that's interesting. Okay. Sure, why not? My gosh, these guys are still struggling so much down here. The Soviet Army is so incompetent. Hmm. 
I'm just gonna wait and see what's gonna happen with Poland. Poland needs to die, right? <clears throat> and you guys are fighting a whole bunch of a whole slew of enemies. Oh, you're yeah, you're part of the Confederate oh. Commonwealth. So you're fighting America by yourself. Oh, that's so dumb. Are you kidding me? China, go in the war. Jesus Christ, what is wrong with these guys? Yeah, they're not going to get anything out of us. If they don't go in the war immediately, like, I'm, I don't want to... No one's going to tolerate that. Guard the revolution. Pretty much. And then, armor divisions, maybe... Uh, modern artillery. Though our soldiers are brave and fierce, require superior artillery to aid their advance. I don't say no to you. Camel Corps would be kind of cool. Combat reports, eh. Feng Shan. How oh, is resistance and such? Well, it's going okay. Section 3, eh? Here. What's the resistance in Korea? Muddy, huh? Get a lot of compliance. I don't think we have a minister for that, do we? Daily Comm support. Daily Comm support. Damage garrisons goes down. Why are you going... Oh my gosh, stop going to war with so many people. Technocrats. Mediator. No, it doesn't look like it. That sucks. Hmm. Naval AA. Ooh, sortie efficiency would be really good. Can I go with sortie efficiency? I think that'd be really good for us. Wow, we are learning quite a bit with these two generals and field marshal. Zhang Shi Click is gone, which is nice. Um, do forty stuff. That would help immediately. Not oh, sure, guys. That's fine. Come on in. Forty-one. CV fighters. Torpedo bombers. More infantry. Surrender terms of Imperial Quantum Territories. Huh. Alright. Okay, now that's nice. It's really... Probably really hurt the British in the end, honestly. It's good, good, good. I'll take these guys out fast. You guys just kind of sit there and just kind of hang out. Thanks, Iberia. We appreciate it. The means. The big ol' meanies. Hello. Oh, hello. Ah. So after this... Um, we're not gonna worry about this, obviously. I'll come from here. Fall well, Leningrad. Oh, that's not good. We have to invade the Axis. So how do we get down there? From here? Actually, Influx. Dutch East Indies. You are a puppet of the Dutch, who are completely independent. Who actually might join the Axis if we do. Let me just find you guys instead. Go to war them, take that territory out, maybe. We'll see. I'll go with them. Infiltration. I like infiltration. Oh crap, I didn't want a non-aggression pact. It's fine, whatever. One artillery. And then... Do that one too, just in case. 
Ammo, nice. King of a kill, oh. Whoa. I don't think I've seen that one before. My god, supply is so bad around here. You know, with it being so bad, you know, I'm not even going to go over there. Go from this side. Improved computing machine. Nice. Um, tanks. Not going to be worried about that too much. Get some planes. Do you have any more planes? Yeah. All I really care about is having enough dive bombers. For this part. And maybe even having the range to do this, too, maybe? Fall of Paris. That's good. Um... Have an airbase here very soon. Very nice. Modern artillery. Um, bicycle battalions. Mobility is key. Our force will be equipped with bicycles. Drastically improve our ability to maneuver divisions around. Very good. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, let's deploy some planes. There you go. Work on a whole bunch of air superiority. We're just navy bombing them. We're just bombing them. In general. Thank you. Now I can help put down some resistance. Help us get more compliance first. Mm, we need more stability. Holy crap. Economic abilities. Deploy heavy AA. Hmm. We'll be alright. Justification for war. Ones wouldn't be bent either. There's McLeek, that's good. Grab you two. You guys done. I'll start preparing you guys for this too. I'll uh, take out the Marine here. Send him back over here and you can add this guy. There we go. Come down here. Nice. Saigon to. There. Then one, two, three. From maybe here ish to there ish. Took a while to get down there. Try it. Fall of Oslo, not bad. Actually. Oh, let's see Baltic cooperation. What? Oh, so what? What's going on here? Huh, the Mina Moors. Balkan Defense League. Holy crap. How are these guys losing so badly? Why are the Soviets so bad? I don't know. I might have to do some fucking stuff off screen for this. But some comments, such as Isn't Kind of Japan one of the hardest nations to play in the mod? Someone says, uh, yeah. I don't know this is too. Someone says, I haven't seen any Let's Plays of Comics of Japan out yet, but thanks for this one. Yeah, cool. Yep, you're welcome. Someone says, I relate to the Mongol Autonomous, or United Autonomous Government, or whatever it was called. I also get a kick out of making agreements and immediately betraying them without a second thought. Someone says, the first thing to be done as soon as Japan turns red is to collectivize all the waifus. Someone says, let's do our best. And someone says, this is what I needed. Someone also, also asks, can you do a George McGovern USA? Which is a person you can play as in TNO, and I think I've done him before. Someone says, Comics Japan, hmm. Someone says, nice. Someone else says, uh, Greg. Yeah. And then someone, and someone also says, well, the only crime bigger than communism is Takuda's hairline. Ha. Huh. Very nice. Very nice. Oh, hello. Soviet Union better not capitulate. I don't understand how they're doing. Well, I guess I have Italy too now. Aren't you fighting? What else are you fighting besides us? 
The birds can't do anything, too. Uh. Can it? Oh, my goodness. What the heck? I'll do some book stuff off screen, but we'll see. Trying to find it here is going to be probably nearly impossible. We do have error. It's nice. Doing an okay amount of damage. One tower to town would be good. Nice. Let's spread out. We lost a lot of resources too. Artillery especially and support equipment which is not good. Carrier fighters. There you go. And more arty. Never enough. Never, ever, ever, ever enough. We just did this. You guys poised to go? Well, we will see. And here we are out there, everybody. Hopefully, oh god. Mexico did join our faction. They just declared war on somebody. That's not good. But we're doing supremacy of will. Um, the most advanced equipment is useless without a fierce man to wield it. And fierceness can turn to the simplest rock and the deadliness of weapons. Uh, we'll do lunge mines maybe next. Get a little heart attack and piercing. But let's do depth, defense and depth. Or this one. Raise a bond tie. Or this one first. Um, work in progress. Yay. Also, Romania did join our faction, so that's actually really nice. And they've been able to push in really hard. I guess uh, Slovakia did capitulate. I'm not sure how these guys came about, though. The West Ukrainian People's Republic, which, you know what? I'm okay with. <clears throat> Vienna has fallen. Slovakia is dead. Poland is dying. Overall. Oh, what happened to Austin? <coughs> Excuse me, everybody. My voice just does not want to work right now. United Baltic State. Um, oh, and there goes the Hellenic Republic, so... The Romanian Armed Forces, I guess we're... Yeah, Romania's... Why is they so strong? Why are they so strong? Why are they so strong? All I want to do is to go to war with Siam. So, I'm going to leave it up to all of them on the other side there to do stuff. I married guys like 40 Combo with. It's probably a really bad idea, but whatever. Can we actually go in at all? Uh, we're struggling definitely down here. Hmm. Not good. Do that too. It's fine. It's fine. Yeah. It's fine. Let's see what we can do. Oh, that actually pushed us out, huh? That's not good. We lost 84,000 people, though, so far. Uh, damage. Oh, now we have air superiority. It's good. Yeah, there's no point fighting a war if you don't have air superiority. I've learned that the hard way several times, and I still learn that the hard way. Doing well on fuel. A little more submitted because we improved working conditions as well. So we'll see. Um, huh. Worst defense. That's an interesting choice to make. The AI sometimes loves, loves to do that. Sometimes. Not always, but sometimes loves to do that. Gets us, huh? So can't we down there, huh? So good air superiority, though. Do that one. Actually, go over here, too. Do that, too. Finally got some more stuff there. Nice. Oh, that's a lot of convoys sunk. Is there anything else here? No. I have a lot of convoys. Probably shipping out a lot of rubber. Which, I mean, I do that too, but still. I'm out. It's only two divisions. Supply is pretty bad down there, not gonna lie. Pretty darn bad. Um, nuclear stuff? It's 41. Costa Rica. Aviation. Eh. We went to Bangkok, which is good. Technology wise, where are we? Battlefield support. Operation integrity is what we like to do sometimes, but, you know, whatever. It's fine. It is Bank is ours. It's nice. It's good. After this. Are you guys in the Allies? No, you're not. You can try it. We didn't go to war with the Dutchies. It is because they're guaranteed by both uh, the Free Australian State, and, as well as British Malay, and they're a puppet of the British, basically. Yeah, they are. And I don't want to fight the British in this campaign, I'll be honest. I really don't. I am. I forget how we went to war with these guys, but whatever. He gets way more rubber. Way, 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 way more rubber. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh boy. They are losing guys like crazy. Uh, sure, guys, I guess. Let's have some coffee here. Very nice. Don't even call it in these guys. 
Just making sure it's all only us. And we're really out of support equipment now. Which sucks. Um, supply bases. Do one down there, maybe? Yeah, might be able to reach up here, but let's see. Let me do that. Um, finish that stuff first, that's fine. We get influx, nice. We do want to go to uh, total mobilization. I did go to extensive conscription just in case for that, so that's good. Uh, subs, carriers, stuff like that, that'd be good. Uh, compliance, how, how are we doing up here? Also, we did take out the communist giants. That was actually really easy. Once, once you just throw in a bunch of cast, it's super easy, so. Uh, okay. I wish we had more guys who help us get more compliance. We're doing quite a bit better with these guys now, which is awesome. Wow, holy crap, they're actually doing... Whoa! Oh, they're fighting Italy. Oh, okay, so the Balkan Defensive... Get... Okay, so that's actually really good for us. Turkey during the Mita Moors, which is probably a bad idea. Warsaw's about to fall-ish. Ish. Death, defense and death, this is very nice. Oh, uh, I got that one done. Embrace Jungle Warfare. Oh, we could use that, work in progress. Uh, Lunge Mines, work in progress. Cool. Um, heavy ship pulls. We don't, probably don't have enough armed naval to be for this. And honestly, as you can tell from the title... This is the last episode of this, this part of the campaign, of this campaign in general, just because... Go ahead and move on and see what other uh, campaigns we can do. It's not worth using yet. So... Cruiser holes, these are heavy cruisers. Early subs. Yeah. Get more, get more of these guys, why not? For now. Oh, crap! No! No! Where's that from? Wait. Russian Republic. Oh, they're down here. What? How did you... Huh? I me no understand right now. Rome falls with Slovene troops. That's cool. Hey, better spot consumption, better attack on core territory, and did command part and multiplier. Love it. I love having six research slots. That's that's just very strong. Heavy bombers, that stuff over there. Let's go to this one. Eighth generation combat chance. Yes, please. Hey, more divisions, nice. Where are we at? Down here. Yeah, I was like, oh my goodness. Oh no, not the Civil War now. But no, see, it's not bad for us. I just wish we more factories. That's why I want to go to total mobilization just in case. Cool, cool. And these Marines are definitely better than before. Because we are using these guys, 41 combo with logistics, which we have to have logistics for these guys. And these Marines are slightly better with 18 combo with, and these guys are still looking okay. Actually, you should probably get some anti-air. Do we have any anti-air? Oh, we have plenty of anti-air. Of course, we're not going to fight anybody with really too much air superiority, so. But you never know. Uh, more rubber, we don't really need that, honestly, but whatever. Sure, hold the Malaya, yeah. I'll take your stuff. Because the hole's nice. Not too many guys with cruisers around here, but that's okay. Republic of India. We'll see. They're still struggling down here, struggling over here. I just want to capture the axis, take out China, and then keep doing other stuff. So, lunch mine's nice. I could work in Peru. Oh, watch out now. Um, diversified tank rolls. I like that one a little bit more. Armored divisions. Other nations have already learned the power of the armored division. We must not fall behind. And develop more advanced and more powerful armor models. Along to strike at the enemy both hard and fast. Because we love it hard and fast. Yeah, we'll see. I only want to go to war with China once the Germans are defeated, though. Which I think is a good goal. Ooh, almost 200, nice. Start to struggling, which is great. Now, let's take a look here. The Soviets, do you still have a debuff of minus 15%? Or, yeah, you still have a debuff. I should play the Soviets again sometime, just for fun. Just for funsies. More ships. Destroy ones. Holy crap, they suck. Nice. Yeah, just keep training. Train, 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 train. When done, train some more. Yeah, seriously. You need more fighters? It's fine. You go right there. Uh, medium bombers? There you go. Hey, there goes Italy. Nice. Just 
Just in case too. Good. Getting really ready for that stuff. So uh, hopefully soon, the, when we come back together, the Reich will be completely destroyed, and then we can kick out China, maybe? Maybe. Raise a bonsai. Probably not going to do that one. Diversify tank rolls. Oh. Fitted with a different kinds of guns with varying traction systems. Armor vehicles can fulfill more varied missions on the battlefield. Agility focus. Range alone will do us no good. Ever models cannot compete with the enemy when they arrive. We must produce craft with superior agility so they may never be outmaneuvered. Uh, range focus. The distances involved um, in, war in warfare in the Pacific Theater are vast, and so we we need models capable of bridging those distances. Bomber modernization. A modernized tactical bomber's key force is key to support our military on the battlefield. All right, everyone. So here we're at. Um, I'll be honest. I'm not sure what the heck is happening. We capitulated the Germans, and we have the Kingdom of Bavarian Hanover here. Or Bavaria, Hanover. And then we also have, of course, Czechoslovak Socialist Republic, East Germany, and I gave, I just divided up Hungary and just give it all to uh, Romania. Austria's here too, Karl Renner. Um, but I don't know what happened. Also, these guys died to uh, the UK. The Soviet Union flipped to the Russian Republic. Um, They literally just flipped. I don't know why. We took out India, we took out Tibet. I want to go to war with China, but. I also want to go to war with Bhutan, and we go to war with Bhutan, they call in China, and China's still in the common turn, but they're not communist. And we were kicked out of the, the common turn faction because we're communist. Because now that even though they're the communist international, the communist international is not democratic. I'm not really sure, so as much as I want to go China now, I, I don't think I really want to at this point, so... Um... Yeah... That's pretty much, I think, where we're going to leave it, just because it was kind of crazy. If I were going to do this again, I would probably make sure that I could actually set up, like, who goes and what stays what direction for communists. I mean, it wasn't bad. It wasn't that difficult, but I just... The problem with the Road 56, especially when you leave it on a historical and you don't do anything about it, um, it gets kind of crazy. And sometimes not in a good way, but, you know, it is what it is. Uh, overall, not bad. We have more than enough manpower on total mobilization. We've got a lot of manpower led, led, led by Tokuda as well. But hey, I think that's pretty much going to be it for us. I'm really disappointed that we couldn't stay in the faction, take out China. But, you know, we'll, we'll have another campaign soon enough where we'll play as Japan, take out China anyway. So, I guess we have the panels unpacked as well. But, you know, whatever. But if you enjoyed the campaign, I'm sorry I didn't show you the uh, end of the war here. But it took, it took a while. It took quite a while. It's for, December 42. But, like I said, if you enjoyed the campaign, leave a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I'll see you tomorrow in another campaign. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.